Cheers, mate. As I'm just doing flow measurement, this time with water. What I can show you now, because it cured with this very old classic fuel chamber cover, this lead is mostly too high. That's my setup for the fuel chamber flow rate measurement with the worst float chamber covers. And what you will see here in a second, look at that. I'm now opening the fuel tap and look at this the round filter chamber cover is not tight it is leaking due to thread which is too high look at that wow so many vespa mates all around the world annoyed by this problem it's the warm start problem look at that I just did file down the very high thread for two millimeters or so that the screw here in the middle can put on some pressure. When it sits on the too high thread, it cannot put any pressure here. There is a little bit of pressure, hey, so we do need some force on the outside that everything is tight. And what you can say here is that it is now tight. I did not change the cover or any gasket. These are the old gaskets. That's a very old fuel chamber from an old S20. And it's tight. So the secret was not the gasket. It was just using a file to shorten that threat. The official dealers, the official workshops have no idea about this issue. But it's so obvious. Jeez, mates. You need to ensure that there is a gap between the lid and the thread. You see this gap here? I would try it without the gasket, rubber gasket ring, because it is easier than to show the problem, the issue. The issue is, you see now, the lid sits on the cover at the chamber, and what happens? It sits in the middle and it wiggles to the outside because the thread is too high. There are different kind of these lids and these two parts obviously don't fit together because the thread is too high or uh, the lid is too low, it should be higher. Uh, proper gap should be there, you see it wiggles and the problem is with one screw you have to make a certain kind of pressure on the outside that it is tight that no fuel is sweating out here and if it sits in the middle too high and it wiggles or the rubber ring shrinks it is for sure that this carburetor with this lip and this filter chamber will gonna start lake and this will cause a flooded engine and especially warm starting problems. How you solve the issue with these two parts? You just take a rasp and lower it so that the lid properly sits on this edge and then you solved this potential flooded engine issue. Cheers guys!
How's it going? Cover at the casing, a speciality of Vespa engines. The cover at the sits in a closed case. Usually there are rubbers everywhere and it's a closed room. Here connected to the frame where the fresh air comes in from that hole under the seat. What does a flooded engine, ground engine mean? In case of a Vespa, it does not mean that the engine it's connected here over the intake is full of fuel it just means that the air in this room here in this closed casing is too rich so the engine cannot start too rich air means at the Vespa engine that kind of the engine is drowned it's a flooded engine but remember it doesn't need to be a lot of fuel in the engine just the air inside the casing is enough that you will have warm start issues the engine does not start <laughs> Sorry, ja. Bist du deppert? Ist das ein Biest jetzt? <lacht>